You might be seeing headlines like this, floating around scientists find rare tusked whale alive at sea for the first time and promptly shoot it with a crossbow. I'm coming up. And while yes, that technically did happen, I'm going to explain to you why it's not as bad as it sounds. This is the ginkgo beaked whale. And beaked whales, by the way, are just some of the weirdest creatures. Let me show you one of their skulls. Okay, so here is an example of the tusks that beaked whales have. Here's another picture, just bizarre. And then here they are having protruded out through the top of the head which I guess is just where they go. And then this is the actual um, picture or one of the pictures that they got of this ginkgo's whale. And now beaked whales are described as being the largest animal that we know almost nothing about. So in terms of the scale of, you know, what we know about creatures, it, we tend to know a lot more about the large animals because they're easy to find. That's not the case with these guys. They tend to be extremely deep divers. And so previously, people had only seen these animals after they had already passed just dead individuals washed ashore or in bycatch. And like I said, that's pretty normal for beaked whales being that they live exclusively out in the deep, deep sea. Now back to the headline that was designed to pull you all in, and I hope that it did because we want people to learn things. But basically, they did see this animal for the very first time. I don't know that they exactly knew what they were looking at when they saw it, but what scientists can do is they can take a whole whole punch DNA sample. And so yes, there was a crossbow involved, not in the way that you might think, but it basically takes a small puncture out of the skin and blubber layer and allows them to do a number of tests, but um, mainly the DNA, which allowed us to know that this is the first time that this animal has ever been seen alive. Anyways, I thought that was pretty cool.